All right, today we're going to talk about Makino's new Hyper Eye Control for Sinker EDM. And uh, the release of this system actually um, uh, marks the unification of Makino EDM controls. So essentially we have the same control and interface for both our wire EDM and sinker EDM. And this will allow any operator to very easily uh, actually operate either machine type. So what we're going to do, we're going to highlight some of the key features on the sinker hyper eye control. And what we've done is our screen itself is a 24 inch uh, high definition touch screen and how we've actually marked the, the interface uh, is it's kind of like a giant iPad or smartphone technology. So what we've tried to do is we tried to eliminate that, that fear of an operator having to know, you know how do I interact with the machine to something that he instantly knows and understands. Uh, so we, we have a lot of touch screen, a lot of graphical uh, functions. So it's very user friendly, very intuitive. And really, you know, the interface method is something that most people do day in, day out without, without having to think about it. So again, we want that user friendliness, we want it to be very inviting, and also be able to provide high functionality to give you the best productivity uh, and efficiency. The control system is actually broken down into three main steps. So in running the machine, uh, you will use three pages, which is essentially your program, setup, and run. So program, here's where you're going to pick your power settings and tell the machine what you want to do. The setup is going to align all of your electrodes and establish all of your work, work coordinates and locations. And run is where you're going to check my program and, and hit cycle start and begin operation. We have uh, CAN cycles already built in uh, that pretty much cover all the type of different work an, an operator might encounter in the shop. Uh, for example, we have standard closed sided machining. We have a package for rib machining. We have gate machining uh, already done. So there's many cycles that are already pre-programmed that dramatically minimize the amount of information and setup um, in, in data input that an operator has to do. So by establishing these packages, uh, really all an operator has to do is you know, tell the machine what kind of workpiece material and electrode material and really his, his locations and, and depths amount and he's ready to go. So again, we're kind of dramatically streamlining what the operator has to do and we're doing it in a graphical, very easy, uh, very easy to use, um, very easy to use method. Uh, another key item and element is all of the different uh, orbit settings we have. So again, everything is done very graphically. So whether you want to do uh, a 2D orbit, a square, circular, or actually even a true 3D spherical orbit, everything can be controlled very easy and, and graphically by the operator. And what's important here is it gives an operator, a, a, you know, an experienced operator, as well as a, a novice or beginning operator, it gives them the, the power to quickly, quickly do the tasks they need to on the machine. Uh, another key area is on our setup screen, where we've dramatically improved the, the, uh, the ease of use, is all of our pickup cycles are now graphically driven, and we've, uh, we've also streamlined how, how many data inputs and keystrokes that the operator actually has to do to perform their tasks. So for example, we have several pickup cycles. Uh, I think there's seven different cycles on here right now for aligning, uh, using a tooling ball to align the, to establish a work coordinate with the probe system. So again, what's nice here is everything is driven graphically, so it's very easy to use. And what we want to do you know, for the operator, if they have any questions or issues, is we want them to have, you know, have the help and assistance they need on the machine. You know, we don't want them having to go dig through manuals or search out information. So what we've done is we've provided them a lot of uh, embedded support that's directly on the machine control. Uh, for example, if I have a question about finding the center of a workpiece, uh, I have a hot link that brings me directly to the manual, uh, manual sector, the onboard manuals brings me directly to that section. So here, here's the information I need right at my fingertips. Uh, another item that's very helpful is we have embedded training videos. So in the event you have a, a question question on videos, the machine has uh, you know, an audio and video tutorial that brings up and goes through all of the detail settings of this function and also has video showing you exactly how this, uh, this setup feature is going to work. So really what we've done with um, with the addition of all these helpful features, uh, we've really kind of streamlined and we've, we've empowered the operator with all the tools they need literally at their fingertips.
Uh, and lastly, on our, on our run page, again, from a program setup run, you know, lastly will be our run page where here's where I'm going to tell the machine this is the program I want to run, and I hit cycle start and begin operation. Uh, here, again, everything is done graphically, so a lot of the program information uh, in terms of status, uh, you know, in a program, you, an operator can very easily see. Uh, here's where my program, my, my beginning process, here's my current process, here's my end process. So it's very easy to see a status update on where the machine's at uh, in a current operation. And another key item is all of the features we have to help the operator in processing the work. So for example, we have our easy cut function, which allows the operator to raise or lower the machining speed, uh, to maybe to improve uh, stability of the cut, which will reduce cycle time. So again, this is a, a slider bar that's going to change several uh, E-code uh, machining parameter settings. And what's nice here is an operator of, of any skill level can easily take advantage of this, this convenient function. And just by a, a simple click on the slider bar, it's going to change several elements behind the scenes for me automatically. Uh, another great item, great feature and benefit to the operator is what we call our eTech doctor function. And what we've done here is we've, create, we've created a little program or applet uh, where we've taken an advanced or experienced user or even an applications engineer and some of those advanced knowledge and, and things we have in our heads uh, we've been able to put into a little easy to use graphical program. Uh, for example, we have functions to improving machining stability, for improving machining accuracy, and also improving surface finish. So what's nice here is Again, regardless of skill set of the operator, they can easily uh, take advantage of these, these features and improve the product, improve productivity, improve quality of your workpiece. These are just some of the snippets that we wanted to cover and, and highlight on a new control system. There's certainly a lot more in here to, uh, to help and assist the operator even further. Uh, please, if you are interested in learning more on the Hyper-Eye Control or Makino EDM, please visit our website and also take a look at our webinar archive. Uh, as we have many, uh, many of these technologies and features uh, in more detail there. Or also contact your local Makino representative uh, or call our technical uh, number at 888 Makino 4